adults. Um, and there's this saying that I absolutely love that said anybody can give away something expensive, but only those who know um, true sacrifice can give away something valuable. And if we can, if we can learn to sacrifice, if we can learn to say, I have these desires, I have these things in me, but I'm willing to sacrifice them and put them on the altar for a minute and let God, um, let God grow me and teach me and train me, then we can give away something of value to our future spouses. Um, but I think um, the value piece is not emphasized anymore in our generation. And uh, it's not something that is of importance anymore. But um, even our first kiss is kiss kisses um, <laughs> is extremely valuable to us. We've learned to value those things, and that's something that we want to give our husbands that we have paid a dear price to keep up to this point. So, um, so just know that that you need to value yourselves first and see how valuable those those gifts are that you have. Um, I, know, I know, we're just passionate about the subject, but one more thing. I know a lot of times people are like, oh, well, you're just career woman, and you guys, you know. I think a lot of people are like, oh, we want to get married when we're later, you know, not until, you know, 55. Um, but we were raised to be good wives and good mothers. I mean, that's how my mom raised us. She was married in 19, my brother was married in 19. I mean, you know, we, that's how mom raised us, to be the Proverbs 31 woman. That was, that was what, how we were raised. And so we all were expecting to get married early. Um, but then God got a hold of our heart. So I just want to let you know, you know, it's not like we don't want to be married. I think a lot of times people think that. Um, but we're waiting for God's timing, and his timing is never our timing. So, but it's going to be the best timing. So, yeah. Good. All right.